Now, if you've been a part of my channel for a while, you know that I really like horror. And I've never really delved into Skyrim horror mods before, and this is what makes this really interesting, because I don't really know what to expect. And here we have one of the first Skyrim horror mods I ever heard about, Clockwork. Now I'm really excited to try this, and if you guys like it, then let me know if you want to see more. Of course, every story needs its hero, and our hero today is Sully a dark elf refugee who came to Skyrim seeking adventure, and he hopes to have hit the jackpot on this one. And off we go outside of Windhelm, finally. Let's see if we can find this so-called rumored mansion, or whatever it is, or like a palace, I guess. I believe it was southeast of Windhelm? Alright, yeah, so it's about south of Windhelm. I guess this should be the right way. It has been so long since I played Skyrim, and honestly, I'm happy that I'm back. No lollygagging. I'm not lollygagging, I am an adventurer headed for adventure. You watch yourself, madam. Okay, so a little bit ways off Windhelm, we are now in Einsgrove. And if my suspicions are correct, as long as we, yeah, as long as we hug these mountains, we should be able to find the place that everybody was talking about. Yeah, uh, we are for sure avoiding those. Don't mind me, I'm just a wee little dark elf, minding my own business, looking for adventure. You don't need to worry about me, dear friend. Ah. Hello there. I come in peace. I lied. But maybe the difficulty is a little bit too easy, because what is this? Just another day in Skyrim, I guess. Sure. Rag Swallow Slow. That is it. So it is southeast of Crag Swallow Slope. I mean, this cave is the only thing southeast of Crag Swallow Slope I see, so. I guess this might be it. Shadow Under the Mountain. Is this it? I've discovered some ruins in East Marsh that led under the Velothi Mountains, and they look like they've been recently uncovered by a landslide. Whatever lies inside has likely been undisturbed for a very long time. Alright, alright, alright. The doorway to the ruins appears unstable. It seems likely that going through it will cause it to collapse, trapping you inside and any followers outside. This will prevent you from returning to Skyrim until you find another way out. Well, adventure is what we're here for, isn't that right, Mr. Sully? Look at him. He's ready for adventure. I've never really been on uh, that many adventures before. This is actually my first time, so I really hope nothing incredibly life-scarring happens while I'm in there, because that would be really unfortunate and a really bad way to end my first time. In we go, I guess. Velothi Mountain Tunnels. Ah. Well, I mean, hey, they didn't lie when they said that the tunnels were unstable. So we have to find another way out. Or we can just sit here and dig. Eh, well, we'll just continue. That's what we're here for, right? We're adventuring. Camilla's Trail, Part 1. Isidore, got sick of waiting for you. I've gone on ahead to scout the tunnels. I'll put up some torches to light the way. Pick up your feet and follow them to find me. I mean it. Hurry up. I want to see your fingers stained from finding this note with the ink still wet. Something in this place makes my hair stand on end. It's as if the shadows are moving. Camilla. I'll take the arrow. Some leather. Rune book. You're right, nothing for me, I guess. We have a torch on us by any chance. We do not. It is quite dark. It doesn't help that I have a window behind me that is literally reflecting off the screen. Broken Iron Warax Head. Wait a second. 
That's cool. I don't think I've ever seen that. Sapphire? And a flawless sapphire. Do not mind if I do. Broken sword handle. We use this? Hey there. What brings you here? Um, I see you. Alright, I guess they don't want to talk to me. Which is fine. I understand that. I'll just... Just... I'll just make my way up to you then. What's the worst that could happen, right? You don't have any superpowers, do you? Well, you have superpowers. I don't blame you for that. Yeah, uh, sure. We'll just we'll just pretend that we're seeing things. It's kind of hot in here. We're just seeing mirages, I guess. Don't have any lockpicks, which is a bit of an issue. But hey, what's the worst that could happen, right? Going on forward to this. Uh... Yeah, there's the torch that we've been asking for. Another note, part two. Isidore, Dwemer Ruins. I thought this was just an old imperial palace, but no, that must have come later. There's more than that here. This might be it. This could change everything for us. Just be careful. There is someone else down here. Something's not right about her. Always disappears before I can get a good look. I can't leave though. Not now. Amilla. Another arrow? Thank you, thank you. There's the lady again. Just gonna check if there's a little something. A flute! Wonderful. I can play some tunes. Hey there. Yeah, I wish I had a bow. I don't. Maybe it's not nice to shoot at strangers. But then again, what do I know? I'm still a green thumb adventurer, so... Yeah, she's still there. Spiders. Hey there. What's up? Oh, that was not hard. I'm so used to playing legendary difficulty that I keep forgetting that, like, lower difficulties are just completely easy. The Dwemer know how to pick their spots, you know? Ah, nice place to sit. It's going to reflect on what we've done so far. Absolutely nothing. Ah. Well then. How pleasant. A uh, lockbox. I don't have lockpicks. We're just gonna ignore that. Uh, we can just skip that, right? Well, another point of no return, I guess. I guess it's just like a Dwemer sauna? I don't know. That is what it looks like. A skeleton. More gold for me. Adventuring is going quite well. We've already made four gold. Pardon me. Hi. You look wonderful. You look great. I love the makeup that you have going on. Isidore, this is all wrong. Can't go back, can't face it. Where are you now, Camilla? Yeah, I'm just gonna leave. Okay, there you go. Is this ink? Or is it just burn marks? Can't tell. Bone hollow. That was kind of unsettling, I will be honest. Jerry! It's been forever since I saw you. Look at you. Looking better than ever. Look at you. You've got like three more polygons than Morrowind. A skull. I'll take you with me, Jerry. You be sure about that? Hey, just catch up, all right? Hey. Ah, oh. hey, it's Jerry's whole family. Hey there. Oh, nice teeth you have. Oh, hey, it's Uncle. Oh, nice eye sockets. I don't think I've ever seen you before. Oh, you're the shy type, I understand that. Hey, hey, Mama Jerry, Papa Jerry. Look at all the Jerry's. I've never felt more comfortable in my life. Let's leave you guys to it. Have a nice day, you hear? What is that? Is it just... 
a light source? Hey, I've never seen that in Skyrim, actually. I've never seen a moving light source in, in Skyrim. That's actually kind of cool. What beautiful eyes you have. Oh my. So far, we've gotten pretty rich. We haven't. We're still poor. I have so much debt, you have no understand. You, like, spare some change. I really appreciate it. This is the coolest thing I've seen in Skyrim. More gold. Hey. Oh, I thought this was like the beginning area that we were in. Huh. Expected something to be up there. Is this the infamous Camilla? Oh, it is. Ah. Well, I guess... I guess our adventuring is done. We just got everything that we needed. Alright, let's read. Camilla's Trail. I needed you, and you aren't here. I always thought those were your footsteps, but they aren't. Always coming up behind me, but nothing there. Time stood still, and she came towards me. Slowly. Slowly. I couldn't move. I couldn't leave anymore. I can't face it. Can't go back out into the world. I'll just sit here and stay with the bones until it's over. I am sorry for your loss. Well, I guess that's what adventuring does to somebody. Well, well, I took her armor, so, you know. Look at us. At least, we're warm now. Hey there. Okay. Hey, why do I hear... Why do I hear air raid sirens? Yeah. No, you should back away, not come towards me. You should back away. You should not. Air raid sirens do not exist in Skyrim, I think. Oh, she just closed the door. Jerry, what did I tell you about sneaking up on me? You can't keep doing that. That actually kind of scared me. That was a funny trick, Jerry. Uncle Joe, what are you doing? That's impolite. Close your mouth. You just go back? Jerry's abstract art is kind of concerning, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, thank you. That's not nice, but whatever. Hey, this changed, didn't it? Well then, uh, sir, you have... Oddly long limbs. I'm not judging, but it's not really natural. Well, your balance is pretty good, sir. I'll leave you to it. There's like that one Dark Souls boss. I got his name from Dark Souls 1. Oh, well, I should have known that you live. Look kind of obvious, but you have weapons, and the other skeletons simply just don't. Now I'm thinking, how long must have it taken to, like, model each skeleton one by one? Hello? Ah. Uh, was I interrupting you with something? Uh. My man has that crimson chin jaw. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave him alone. Uh, you guys enjoy your time. You know, now that I think... Yeah, I'm not gonna touch that. Uh... I don't want to get cursed or anything. Hey, buddy. That's nothing personal. The Lothi Tunnels Glass Lake. Ah. Oh. Wait, hold on. This ice effect is the coolest thing ever. I've never seen anyone do this. That's so cool. This actually looks like a frozen lake. Nah, that's actually the coolest thing ever. I love this mod so far. Uh, what? Pardon me? Uh, am I supposed to avoid you? No, you seem pretty friendly. You should wear shoes, though. It's kind of cold down there. Actually, do you want to, like, get up here? I'll, we'll find you, like, a towel or something, because it looks really cold. Nah? Alright, I, th I think she's fine. This is incredibly cool, don't you think? Yeah, she seems to agree. Hey there, buddy. Just passing through. Don't mind me. And we leveled up. How fortunate. You know what that means. More health. 
and more damage for sure. 20% damage, that is, in fact, 20% more damage than we dealt before. Look at that. Oh, anything down here? Oh, hey. You're... Hey there. You don't have to scream. You're just gonna... You're just gonna stay floating there? Hmm. Well, what happens if I touch you? Do I just die? Oh, I just take damage. You're free to follow me if you'd like. Something in here. Coin purse. More gold for us. I think we lost her. Oh, no, never mind. There she is. Jerry. How are you doing? Do you know I can get this person? Yeah, she's right there. And yeah, do you know I can get her away from me? She's like, kind of annoying now. Ah. Uh, oh, thanks, Jerry. You gave me some gold. You're right, maybe I could bribe her here. Genius idea. A garnet. All for you. Oh. She didn't want it. Yeah, it's fine. You know, I'm not hurt. A big chest with a master lock. Yeah, we're not gonna open that in our lives. Hey there. Oh, I think she stopped following us. How did I not hit you? What? Hello? Okay. Alright, this is a bit awkward. We finally did it. I don't have any health potions. Are you stuck? Oh. Hey. She's stuck. You obviously stand up, yeah. Hey, I wish I had an elevator. I know fair. Keep on doing whatever you're doing. I'm just gonna leave. Oh, nope, there you are. Yeah, I'm closing the door. Left or right? Hey, do I go left or right? Right it is. Thanks. Where do I go now? Oh. Why are there air raid sirens suddenly? Alright. I'm just gonna make my way out then. I guess I'm unwanted here. Wait, is she behind us? Uh, I can't really tell. I don't really know, actually. I think it's just air raid sirens. Did I take a wrong turn? I mean, no, the quest marker's there. But how am I supposed to get through there? Uh, I don't really think that's how it works. Lockwork Castle Grounds. Alright. Let's go check it out. Well, we're not getting through there either. This is very unstable, despite, despite there being supports. But, you know, I'm not one to judge. Oh my god. That is the coolest thing. I've ever seen in a Skyrim mod. The title just hanging up there. Lockwork. And it just fades away. And who might you be? 